So hello everyone and it gives me immense pleasure to introduce Dr. Sathvi with all of you. She has got an amazing rank of double digit 29 in the INICT. So heartiest congratulations Sathvi. Thank you ma'am. And I think this is the best gift that she could have given to her mother. We were talking and she said that my mother actually started crying. So actually, you know, when uh, you are very, very happy, you actually burst into the tears. And so are we. We are really very happy. She has an amazing jump from rank 2000 in the NEET PG to double digit rank in this INICT. So Satvi, introduce yourself. Uh, I'm Satvi Kayam. I'm from uh, Mysore Medical College, Karnataka. Uh, I've got uh, 29 rank in INICT, May session. Um, I had taken uh, Bhatia as my um, uh, regular batch. preparation, regular batches. I was uh, a student in face-to-face uh, uh, -face classes, which used to be in uh, Bangalore. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So uh, your sole uh, source of preparation was DBMCI, right, Satvi? Yes, yes ma'am. Right. So how did you start it with us and how did you like the classes, Satvi? Uh, Ma'am, actually, uh, my elder sister, she was also in Bhatia. Uh, okay, she uh, was also a student. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. She had got the rank of 300 in her uh, NEET PG and mm -hmm. 100 rank in her uh, AIMS uh, exam. That time it used wow. to be Wow, brilliant sisters. <laughs> <laughs> yes, ma'am. So, she insisted me to join Bhatia. And uh, till my internship, I, I was not preparing for NEET or INICET. After internship only, I started preparing. So I joined the uh, uh, Bhatia classes in Bangalore. Um, then I attended all the classes. I have never missed any classes. And yes, ma'am, I just followed like what teachers told me and what my sister told me. I have just followed that, nothing else. <laughs> Okay, and the result is in front of you, Satvi. Yes. Uh, right. So, mm -hmm. which classes did you like more, Satvi? Uh, like, ma'am, subject-wise or uh, subject-wise? Okay. Yes, subject-wise. Subject-wise, um, I, I like microbiology from Nazir sir and uh, Tamim sir's medicine classes and um, psychiatry, ma'am, Ankur sir. Like, what can I say? It was like a... Um, Therapy for me also. His classes is <laughs> so nice. As a psychiatry and even biochemistry. And yes, ma'am, like I can't take the names. Like each and every classes were so perfect. And each and every moment I have felt that, oh, I'm so, I mean, I'm so lucky to be in this profession. Like you guys have made me feel like for the first time, maybe I'm feeling like that. Like, oh, I'm so uh, lucky to be here, like to take MBBS and to know so many things. Like more than ma'am, more than cricket, uh, cracking these uh, entrance exams. Like, you need that confidence in your profession. Like, yeah, uh, I have made the best choice. Like, you guys have made me feel like that. I'm so grateful for that, ma'am. Okay. So, mm -hmm. what is the best thing about the classes that you felt that you did not need any other thing and uh, only this source, soul of preparation was helpful for you? Uh, I like to say, like, before starting my preparation, like, I like to say that trust on my sister. She told, just follow TBMCI, that's all. You don't need anything. She even told me, like, if, uh, like uh, in third year and all, people start preparing, no, ma'am, uh, regular classes and everything. She was like, no, you don't have to worry. Finish your internship, you join Bhatia, and they'll take care of you. <laughs> you can oh, do it. <laughs> so sweet. So, yes, it is just like a family, and we are very, very happy that we are a part of the journey of both the sisters. Amazing, <laughs> right? Yes. Right. So, mm -hmm. uh, you followed all the classes then? Uh, yes, ma'am. I followed all the classes. Few classes. I missed few classes because, ma'am, when uh, I'm from Chikmagalur, uh, here I stayed in a PG and I uh, I was attending classes. Uh, I don't know the weather or PG. I don't know. I used to fall sick very often. Like every 15 days, I used to fall sick. In oh. between, like I had got dengue in between in the month of September. I had missed um, uh, anatomy and the uh, biochemistry classes. So I covered it up with uh, online rec recorded classes. Mm -hmm. uh, that's it. Uh, uh, other than that, I have attended all the classes, ma'am. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. And uh, were you giving the test series and vibe also? Uh, 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 vibe I have attended, ma'am. Test series, like I had not taken any uh, test series course. Uh, the grand but, test and uh, the. Uh, yes, ma'am. I used to give them. 
Yeah. I used to give them regularly, ma'am. Like my sister insisted me to give tests like every day because as she used to tell, you need that uh, uh, thing like you have to have the three hours focus for the tests, and that will come by practice. Like you have to practice every day. Mm-hmm. So I've almost every day I've given. Uh, I I used to like practice MCQs like for three hours. That every day. Every, every day. Wow. Every day. Every day. See, Every students, day. listen to her. <laughs> like all those students who are actually afraid of giving the test through this Satvi, I would like to pass on this message. Then don't be afraid of it. Just face it and you will learn from it. Yes. Yeah. Even um, actually, uh, like um, my sister's marriage was there in December. So till then I had few, uh, one of the other disturbances. I was not preparing that well. After December, like I properly uh, started uh, going through the notes, like preparing for the exam. So I was so afraid, mom, because uh, my scores were not that good uh, before because I was not in the track. Then I-, I was like, if I can't face this now, I have to face it in the exam. So you need to have that uh, confidence and courage that even if you are facing some failure, it's okay for that moment. But you you will learn many more things from that. Mm-hmm. So you have to be prepared for the actual exam. And uh, <laughs> yes, no. Yes. Mm-hmm. So uh, how did you like the vibe, Sadhvi? Uh, vibe was very useful, ma'am. Like for uh, I mean, uh, last two days, no, uh, for my need preparation also, I just went through vibe. Like all 19 subjects you'll get in one book. That's yeah. really amazing, ma'am, because we cannot revise all 19 subjects. So that that was really a package of all important things in one book, and that was very helpful. And also yeah. what we see through images, uh, we tend to retain it more. And yes. I think that's a good way to learn things. Right. And uh, you were giving the test every day, Satvi. So I think there cannot be a better person than you. How did you like the test, the quality of questions, explanations, everything? Yes, ma'am. It was appropriate and it was uh, really good. It was, uh, I mean, it was a very good uh, thing for the preparation. Hmm. I liked all of it, ma'am. Okay, so uh, what do you think should be the ideal time of starting uh, these tests and how actually, uh, what should be the frequency, how often we should give them? Uh, Mama, I feel uh, when we start the exam, uh, when we start our preparations, like since beginning, even if it is day one, start with GTs, it's okay. Like at least we'll get to know where we are, how can we manage those three hours and how much we have to work for it. So, I mean, there's no point getting scared to give a test or something because that will actually tell you where you are, how much you have to work. So, I feel like when you have you have started preparing, you have to know where you actually stand. So, uh, beginning, ma'am, uh, till you finish all the class, uh, all subjects and all uh, subject classes, I think at least once in a month you have to give GTS mm-hmm. and review that properly. Uh, and uh, analyze it because just giving GTs will not fetch us anything. Uh, we have to analyze like uh, where we are, uh, what is your weakest point, uh, which subject you have to get it better, and or uh, you have you should know how many silly mistakes you are doing. So mm-hmm. everything I feel like when um, uh, when there is like three months or something, you have to start giving GTs like fifteen days once mm-hmm. and then uh, weekly ones. I don't know if I can suggest this to people, but I used to give it every day, ma'am, because uh, it was like I could follow what my sister said. How could you uh, review the GT? It's very good that you were giving it daily, but how was it possible for you to review it also? On uh, yes, ma'am, that was the thing. Um, whichever questions I used to get it wrong, I used to review them properly, a little bit faster. Uh, I, I used to go through go through them. And whichever questions I had doubt, no, ma'am. I, I, I used to mark them and I used to go through uh, those questions. I used to uh, look into correct questions also. Because sometimes you would have gotten it right just by some guessings or uh, the approach will be different. Uh, I don't know, ma'am. Like maybe from uh, with practice, you'll get it. I used to mm-hmm. review it uh, sooner. Like morning, 9 o'clock, I used to start tests. Huh? Mm-hmm. And I used to finish it by 12, 12.30. Mm-hmm. And till 2 or 2.30, I used to take time to review all those things. Uh, after that, I used to revise my notes and do other things, ma'am. Okay, so see this, everybody's success story is different, but I think this is a very different story, which we can learn from that we are giving the test daily also, and we are getting it reviewed too. 
I said mm. one thing, Satvi, uh, your rank was 2K in uh, NEET and suddenly, you know, it's not much period between the NEET and this INICT and now you have got 29. So what do you think, what special did you do, uh, did in this period that actually immensely improved your rank? Uh, Ma'am, I think uh, your yeah, hard work is your foundation. Like you might get good rank or bad rank, the basic thing what you need is your hard work that is the first level ma'am after that i feel like it depends on so many things like that day what is your mindset uh, that three hours how are you going to give it so uh i i feel like um i feel like you we have to do our work other than that we have to just leave it to almighty so nothing is there beyond that so i mean without working we can't like uh, um, expect good things or something even if you have you have worked so much and if you have not got good but rank. you work for need also na satvi you work for need also so what do you think that uh, that this thing actually i think what is uh, what do you uh, suggest that this is one thing that i did between the need and inict that you can attribute your success to uh I couldn't analyze it yet, ma'am. But oh. I, I feel like after meet, I was very depressed after meet because of my... So rank. that motivation was high. Motivation was high and you were more focused then. Sorry. Yeah, I was more focused. And <laughs> I think, ma'am, uh, like we, uh, it's not possible to study like everything. We have to be mm. so targeted in things. Even if you do so much of hard work, you have not got a rank. There's some reason you have not, you've done some not mistakes. Perfect. Maybe you are not focusing on what was very important or uh, maybe like that for INI CT ma'am uh, I didn't have so much energy to like again go through all the notes I uh, I, I completely like I uh, started doing all uh, previous year questions and I thoroughly reviewed them ma'am like uh, the topics around it uh, the previous year how they were asked the questions and everything so I think such kind of targeted preparation will help you a lot in yeah so smart then. study is always better than uh, yes. hard study so yes. i think you worked hard for need also but now it you were more focused and you did more of goal directed yeah, yes ma'am uh, yes <laughs> right so amazing journey satvi and amazing rank an amazing idea of giving the test daily. I really hope that many of the students will learn so many things from your journey. And we are very, very delighted to be the part of not only your journey, but your also sister's journey. And uh, we give uh, all the best to both of you for your endeavors in the future also. Stay Thank both. you so much, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you.